friends with me and my sisters, the Braxtons. And I was in college, I was going to Bowie State University, and it played right after summertime, Will Smith summertime. And I knew it was not going to hit. It's like, I, it was that moment like, oh, God, it's not going to happen. And I knew it wasn't going to happen. Not that it wasn't a great song or a fun song, my family and I, but I knew it wasn't going to be mainstream at all. It was not mainstream at all. It sold three copies. My mom, my dad, my grandma. Me and my sisters, the Braxtons. The Braxton, good life. It did, it got attention though, but it was a blessing in disguise because we got, you know, with Ellie and Babyface and that worked out on the other side, so. Right. But it was not gonna be a hit. I don't think anything's a hit following summertime. It could have been um, Lady Marmalade, actually, because we did that 42 years ago. And when we did hear on the radio, I know I, I felt awesome. That wasn't the first song we recorded, but that was the first major song that was played on the radio. And when I heard it, of course, I was excited, but I didn't like, I wasn't blown away, but I was excited because we have a song on the radio. You know, like I see a lot of the moments when uh, people in this industry first hear their music on the radio and they lose it. I didn't quite lose it. Um, actually, I think it was in a supermarket I was just, you know, grocery shopping and I heard the song and I was like, I, I was watching everybody like, do you hear this? Do you hear this? And I was alone, you know, in the supermarket, like, woo! <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> it was fun. Feel?